Hi guys and welcome to my daily cocktail vlog. Today I'm going to show you how to make a Trinidad Sour. So the Trinidad Sour was first made by New York bartender Giuseppe Gonzalez. I think this recipe is going to stay true to the original recipe. It's a very intriguing cocktail, the main ingredient being the Angostura bitters. So it will give that really distinct colour to it as well. So it's a shaking cocktail, so I want to start off with uh, the shaker and measure out 30 mils of Angostura bitters. You can do it the smart way and you can just take off the cap off the top of the bitters. Otherwise, if you're super patient, you can measure it out. It didn't actually take too long. So add that to the cocktail shaker. Then next up, rye whiskey. So just after I've finished saying I'm going to stay true to the recipe, <laughs> preferably use an overproof rye. So something that sits at about 50%. Uh, this is 45, but we'll just pretend. So half shot, 15 mils. Then I'm using bullet. Then next we have orgette. So 30 mils. This is probably a lot darker than usual. This is just a homemade one with uh, made using roasted almonds. So one shot, and then three quarters of fresh lemon juice. So 22.5 mils. Fill your cocktail shake with ice and give it a good shake. Then double strain into your chilled coupe glass. I'm going to leave this one ungarnished. I think that its distinct colour differentiates itself from other drinks anyway. So there you have a Trinidad Sour. Cheers. So that's a well balanced sour. The sweetness from the, the orgette, from the almond syrup and then the, the citrus, but then you've got these, these full on really bold aromatics from the Angostura bitters and a little bit of spice from the rye whiskey. Enjoy guys, cheers.